There are now to our top story here this morning. There is now a second person of interest wanted in connection with the South Street mass shooting. We're going to head over to get the latest now from Eyewitness News reporter Wakisha Bailey, joining us live from Queen Village with the video police want us to see, and also concern from residents, Wakisha, and they were very vocal with officials last night. Yeah, good morning, Janelle. Well, police are calling this a very complex investigation as they're looking for multiple people firing guns here on South Street Saturday evening. Now, police also say that their top priority is getting these shooters off the streets. Now, overnight, police released this vivid images of the second person of interest that they are looking for. The video was taken in a convenience store Saturday night. The person appears to be in his late teens. He has a slimmer and shorter built. He's wearing a black hoodie sweatshirt with red decals and a head covering. Now, earlier this week, police said they were also looking for this man, a heavyset man in his late teens with a bushy afro-like hair. He's also wearing a black hoodie with the same red decals. And police say they are continuing to review surveillance video in and out of stores along South Street leading up to that deadly shooting that killed three people and injured 12 others. Meantime, Wednesday evening, residents in the Queen Village neighborhood met with the city's top law officials. They were emotional, outraged, and pressing for solutions to prevent what they call lawlessness and a rise in violent crime. When everyone just wanted to know what happens Friday night differently. You're going to see horses, you're going to see bikes, you're going to see officers on foot feet, right? Officers in patrol cars, you're going to see special units out there. We recognize we're not perfect. We recognize that even though if our plan we thought was solid at the time, we always go back and reassess it. And right now, the reward is up to $30,000 for anyone with any information that could lead to an arrest. Now, if you know the whereabouts of these individuals, police are warning you to stay away from them because they are armed and dangerous. Reporting from South Street, Wakisha Bailey, CBS 30 Eyewitness News. Yeah, packed house during that meeting last night. Wakisha, thank you for that. And we want you to stay with Eyewitness News for continuing coverage of the mass shooting on South Street. You can always get the very latest on our website, cbsphilly.com, and our stream. Streaming service CBS News Philly.